All right, hello everyone. We are back again. This is the full gameplay for a melee build. Uh, hopefully to get overpowered uh, as soon as possible. Hold on just a second. There we go. So we're only going to be using melee for this. Well, unless we have to use something else, maybe explosives. Actually, no. Uh, let's see. Silver Slugger. Uh, so we're going to have four strength, no perception. Uh, we'll start off with three in endurance. I wish I could dump more here, but I really can't afford it. Uh, intelligence is going to be nine on this. And then we have to have agility of nine as well, because we're going to be using blitz a lot, which is just a great skill to have. Uh, unfortunately, we're not going to be relying on crits too much. And uh, the in strength of four is so that we can uh, access blacksmithing mods early in the game, which is going to be helpful. However, we're primarily going to be using power armor. Fortunately for this one, we won't be spending time scrapping, so that's good. In fact, we'll just kind of run through uh, Sanctuary. Hopefully I remember where the baseball bat is. There is an early game baseball bat. Actually, maybe we'll, uh, we'll build to get to level two so that I can uh, procure something. Not bother with Codsworth. I don't think his quest gives a lot. So, just a little bit of building here. Not too much. So, I'm just going to scrap a few trees. Just so we can build some shelves super quick. Oh, I can only build... Well, that, that's a steel shelf, so okay, that's why. There we go. Now we can build a good amount. There we go. We are level two. Let's get to getting. We can go ahead and grab dog meat for this one because it doesn't matter. We're not going to be stealthy in this at all. The hard part with very hard difficulty is starting out. Go ahead and pick up everything and then we'll just drop the weapons if we don't need them. We're going to use ammo to help us buy what we need. Probably don't even need to worry about stacking charisma gear or anything like that because it's just one item. Come here, doggy. Hey, boy. What are you doing out here all by yourself? You want to come with me, pal? Oh. Right. Hey. Okay, then. Let's stick together. Let's get our drifter outfit on. And we'll just use the security baton for now. Just to kill these two guys up here. Maybe they don't hurt me too badly. Not bad at all. I don't think it took any damage, just some radiation. Alright, so baseball bat, I believe, is in this building. Right behind the door. There it is. So we got a baseball bat. I'm gonna discover the entrance to Concord here. Then let's run back to Sanctuary. 
fast travel, use survival, survival folks are jealous. All right, so what I want to do now is figure out what I need to, whoops. Uh, we just want one rank so that we can do bladed. No, bladed we can't do. We can do chain. Chain wrapped. So that's going to be a good start there, right? And we got the materials for it already. It's actually really cheap. Holy cow. So we'll put one point into blacksmith. I don't think we'll get another rank in blacksmith before this is done unless we somehow get a ton of experience in a couple hours. There we go. So we got a chain-wrapped baseball bat. What color do we like? Mahogany, rich mahogany. There we go. Let's go ahead and dump the weapons we got. Well, not our baseball bat, what am I doing? There we go. And let's go back to Concord. See how this weapon does against these raiders. Once we hit level three, we'll upgrade again to... I mean, I probably should have other weapons just in case I can't reach something, but... I'm gonna... Let's go around the side. Feel a little... Feel a little uh, facetious on this one. Let's see if we can do something around the side here. Again, we're not going to be sneaky at all. We got to get kind of close like this. It's pretty decent, not great. Not as much as I might have hoped, but it's better than nothing. Wow, he took out most of them by himself. All right, we're looking for upgrades to our gear right now, so let's just grab everything and assess. Are there more raiders back here? Did I go around the side and skip them? All right, so we got our out of time complete, which is good. Let's go ahead and start stacking big leagues. Actually, no, Blitz is gonna be first priority. And you know what I forgot to grab was the special book and the other junk. Special book and Grognak magazine would have been nice to grab. Actually, let's do that real quick right now. I go in since I have the waypoint. Wasting time. So we're going to go in here. Grab the Grognak magazine. This can help. I mean, we're not going to get a lot of crits because we're low luck, but it can help. This one we're going to put in Endurance. I'll probably edit that in as if I had done that all on the first time in uh, Sanctuary. Tricks of the trade, folks. So, because we didn't have to spend all that time scrapping Sanctuary, we are a bit ahead, although we're behind on levels. <laughs> I feel like I should just do a bunch of quests and grind some levels, because that's really what's going to take it over the top. Now... Let's uh, assess our gear. We'll just do this, this, this. Uh, we didn't get a lot of stuff, actually. We just got a couple right arms and a chest piece. Do that then, that's fine. Reception bobblehead doesn't do a lot for us in this build. We're not relying on accuracy at all or any perks. It would be nice to have like the demolition expert perk from perception, but we don't. You jackanapes. Okay. So a key to this is going to be sustaining our fusion cores in our power armor. There's a few that I know of, so we'll work on getting those. Did I grab the fusion core? Yeah, I did. So we gotta ignore the ones above. We can do a little teleportation here with our blitz. 
more teleportation with Blitz. Beautiful. Got a right leg. Left arm. Sweet. Let's grab everything. We're probably going to use ammo mostly to buy what we need. Let's uh, stack up a couple more pieces. Left arm, right leg, right arm, chest piece. Uh, we're missing a right leg, it looks like, but that's okay. Honestly, so far this feels okay. Usually very, uh, very hard difficulty feels a little worse when you head up here immediately. Nice death animation, sweet. Okay, that's the problem there. There we go, beautiful. Uh, we got one more alive. Oh shoot, we missed one. Whoa, his head fell off. All right, so a nice headshot there. Uh, yeah, we just missed one coming up. I'm used to just shooting that guy. Summer shorts. Hey, we got some uh, plus two charisma gear. We don't have to worry about that. And a big old bag of cement. How'd I miss him? I literally just ignored him and went this way. All right, wasting a little time, but that's okay. Okay. One good idea can make all. There's a crash vertebrate up on the roof. Old school, pre-war. Okay, like skip, it. skip, <laughs> skip, skip. Uh, mini gun. Now we're talking. Uh, I'll help. Mini gun. We're gonna try to save our ammo. I am not 100% sure how well we're gonna do going melee with the uh, death claw, but we'll find yes. out. We are pretty low level. This is going to be the big test here. The good thing is with a full set of power armor, although it's not repaired, it should take considerably less damage. Uh, I wish I had slept somewhere. wonder if I can teleport away and then come back. Let's see, can I do this? Oh man, I never tried that before, that's hilarious. That's hilarious. So let's repair our power armor real quick. Get rid of those red leg pieces and uh, we'll build a bed. And we're missing just a little bit of steel for the last piece there, so let's scrap this house. And now we got plenty of steel. Oh, and some circuitry as well, okay. So torso requires circuitry, everything else I think is just, just basic stuff. All right, so we got a decent set of power armor. Uh, obviously we can be better. Next up, I wanted to build a bed so that I could just sleep real fast. There we go. Just throw it down anywhere. And now we'll head back over there. Actually, you know what we can do? Let's go get some more fusion cores before we run out of this one. Uh, yeah, that's fine. We can get three more fusion cores pretty quick over here. It's annoying. There we go. Oh man, we need to cut a little bit north. The only, I. I'm really not used to using power armor that much. I just don't play in power armor much because once you get set up with ballistic weave, 
you know, it's just you're not clunked up by power armor. The only thing you're missing really is the jetpack. And that's a big miss, obviously. Big thing to miss. So hoping that this water isn't too deep. Pretty deep. Okay. There we go. Pieces of stuff that I could have grabbed earlier, but it's okay. All right, so we're gonna get three more fusion cores right now, and we could even go do uh, the Abernathy Farm quest if we wanted to to just grind some experience. Yeah, we could grind a little bit of experience before we try to take on the Death Claw. Get a couple levels, I guess. We got danger. Oh my god, we got Meyer Lurks. Whoops. Can I beat them with... Uh... These guys are going to be real tough at this level. I don't know what's going on with bats. That's just tripping out. We're doing okay with the damage so far. One down. The other one's pretty strong. not feel like a good use of time. I probably should have avoided this better. Wait, why is it zero percent chance to hit? Why is it zero percent? Oh, that's dumb. Okay. I mean, got a little experience there. That's okay. None of our armor looks too damaged either. All right, so fusion, well, here's another cool thing to grab. Fusion core one. And then we're gonna run in here and do a paint job. Might use the hot rodder paint job, I'm not sure. Also, we get some Stimpak, Rataway, a lot of goodies in here. So we're gonna play the tape. And we wanna activate the Sentry Bot first. And then we'll wait and hopefully he'll activate. There he goes. Once he's activated, I've always found it works better if you hop out and then do it again for the self-destruct part. I don't know why. It just trips out if you try to do both in the same one. Okay. Wait, did that do it? Okay, self-destruct imminent. All right. Now we just wait and he should explode. Grab our mini nuke while we're here. Although sometimes you have to kick it out like that. There we go. Uh, doesn't seem like it's self-destructing. Okay, let's do it again. Maybe I did it too early. self-destruct imminent there he goes now we get two more fusion cores from that so now we have a total of three fusion cores 
Looks like these mole rats are being dumb, fighting with dog meat. Looks like they share some of the same animations. Okay. Good. Sure, let's go beat up Akak. -Ak. I'm gonna try not to heal here unless I have to, because I'm gonna use the uh, bed up at the satellite array. Olivia, satellite station. Okay, it's warning me that it's getting lower. Now, if you get real, whoa, is that a full set? <gasps> no, it's missing a head. But we can grab all this anyway. Why not? I don't need the frame, but I can grab all the pieces off of it. And now you have extra pieces we can swap out if we need to. There's a couple bloat flies here. Let's go beat them up. All the EXP we need. Next level, we're going to start scaling our melee damage, hopefully. A little bit concerned about a certain mole rat that might try to explode here. There we go. One shot. Love it. Well, the bigger chest piece. Nice. Okay, another one up here. I don't know where those stupid mole rats are, but I am scared. Puppy! For some reason, people don't like it in chat when I say puppy. <laughs> you guys got a connection to these in-game dogs. They're just pixels, man. I don't... Here's the thing. Like, if I considered the dogs to be real dogs, why wouldn't I consider the humans to be real humans? And then I would be morally opposed to that as well. So if I'm not morally opposed to killing video game humans, I should not be morally opposed to killing video game dogs, you know? It's a little bit... I know people like animals, but it's a little bit hypocritical. Okay, good timing. We're about to run out of our first one, but we got three to spare. Okay, it's my habit of saving outside of entrances here. Uh, we'll get another mini nuke in here as well. We'll get a lot of goodies. In here. This is a really good place to go at the beginning of the game, to be honest. I'm still a little concerned because we're not one-hitting these raiders. Oh, I gotta drop some stuff now, finally. Probably drop most of that. Um, oh, because I got a fat man and a minigun here. Drop all these pipe pistols, drop all this stuff, drop all that. There we go. There we go, squish. Get all those goodies. Oh shoot, this is bad timing. I needed to save my uh, bats for Akak. -Ak. Now. Nice one shot on Akak, -Ak, by the way. Red bandana apparently will let dog meat hold more stuff. Okay, we got a level. Cool. I think we got them all. So this level up, let's use it on big leaves. Go. Make sure we this. We already got 16 
Bobby pins? How do we get so many bobby pins? That's awesome. These can spawn as legendary if you're above level 6. Or 6 or above, I should say. Or above level 5 also means the same thing. Okay, we need to make sure we get... Oh, one more. Make sure we get the password. I believe it's inside of this. Intel room key. Yeah, not the password. We don't actually use the terminal. It's weird to me that things in this game have both the option to unlock with a terminal and with a key. Army helmet's good. It doesn't make sense. You're adding redundancy where there doesn't need to be redundancy and actually creating a security risk. I guess if there are no security risks, we wouldn't be doing stuff like this anyway. Got it. Interestingly, by now, I'm about 25 minutes in, I would still be scrapping Sanctuary. So this is a lot more fun being able just to get out there. And I'm currently at level four, so I'm two levels short of where I would be if I just did an EXP grind. Molotov is good. Uh, make sure I grab the Fusion Core out of here as well. Boom. Head up top. I believe sprinting also reduces fusion core. Oh, we need to get science to crap. Nuclear physicist, I should say. Crap. I should have got that first. Okay, there's stuff in here, right? A Braxo cleaner. Nothing that cool. Okay, in here we got a magazine that we don't really need. A few Nuka Colas. Use those to make overdrives. We're out of space again. Pick up everything. We'll figure out what to drop in a second here. We got a novice locked safe. So all these goodies, especially the ammo, is going to be very helpful later on. Yes. And that pre-war money too. Uh, when we're just buying what we need, which isn't a lot. Uh, let's go ahead and drop some stuff. Here, here, here. Drop some weapons. We want to keep the fat man. That might be helpful later. I can drop, well, the minigun's worth a lot, but drop some pipe pistols. Uh, drop a 10 millimeter pistol and we can move now. Okay, so we're not going to pick up anything else. We're going to head out. Wait, did I get the mini nuke? There's a mini nuke in here. I don't remember picking it up, but I must have. Yeah, I must have picked it up. I don't remember, but. Let me make sure my ammo, I have two mini nukes. Good, okay, so I have two mini nukes. Can always come in handy having some mini nukes if we run into a particularly troublesome boss. Could use it on the death claw, but I wanna see what we can do once we start scaling damage better. There's another fusion core we can grab by Red Rocket. So we'll go ahead and do that. We're actually gonna, let's teleport to Red Rocket and I'm gonna deposit the stuff there. And then we're gonna head off to Abernathy. Okay, red rocket. Whoops. Why did that happen? There we go. Transfer, transfer junk. We'll drop both the miniguns here. We don't, we're not gonna, oh, we want the Molotovs though. Those can be helpful. Drop all this stuff off. Honestly, I'm not gonna use any of this stuff anymore. I'll probably use the summer shorts. Uh, we can, we could repair real quick, but that's okay. Let's deposit the extra pieces in here. Not gonna repair yet because nothing's broken. It, it costs the same amount to repair when it's full or you know almost gone. So it's better to hold off and wait. All right, so out here we've got uh, the mole rat den and, and there's another fusion core inside of here. And this supply of fusion core should hold us pretty well for most of what we're doing. 
Especially when we get a nuclear physicist point. Okay, there's a... Uh, black rim glasses over here as well, so we can have a little bit more charisma gear. I swear I said I wasn't going to bother with charisma gear, but now I have. I don't know if there's any cool stuff back here, but you might as well check. Novice lock. Felice novice lock. Felice novice lock. Sweet. Wonder glue. Love it. Bet you'll love it just like Lyle. We could also do armor and try to upgrade our power armor a bit. Fusion core. There we go. Now we've got four backup fusion cores on top of the fusion core we're currently using, which is at 55%. Really need to level soon. <laughs> Shouldn't take too long. Let's go to Abernathy and turn in this quest. Medic is another perk that I want to get pretty quick. Man, we need a lot of perks and we don't have the levels for it. But that's good because with some other builds, it's like you don't have any good stuff to put it in sometimes. Uh, pause. That's what, that's what she said. Okay. Go talk to our dude bro in here. Where you at, dude, bro? Are they sleeping? I don't know where they sleep. Do they sleep on the roof? On the roof? There's Clarabelle. There's the cat. Where are they? I actually don't know if I've come here at night. Hmm. Well, this is bizarre. Okay, they're back here. Blake. Excuse me. That's close enough. Whoa. He was up and at him. If you uh, let me farming's hard work. Won't argue with Blake. I'm Yeah. Good to see. How I'm sure I'll give it a try someday. Well, maybe word of advice. Uh -huh. Why do all the hard work? Sounds like bad news to me. You mm -hmm. last right. Now. Uh-huh. I could hop out of my power armor and get, you know, my two int bonus. I'm not going to bother with it. It's going to take too much time, so. But, it's a little boost there. Is it going to get us to a level? Oh, yeah. There we go. Okay, nuclear physicist. Probably should have got it earlier. 25% uh, longer. Nicely done. Very important for fusion cores. Okay. Now we are at full health. We are ready to attack Concord now. Let's do a hard save just in case. Feel good. Feel good about this. I feel like we can take down this death claw. Maybe I should have got Big Jim and I could have crippled the death claw's legs, but you still gotta fight it. Whoa. It's coming out right away. That's good, he's fighting everything. Uh-oh. Wait, how did that fire start? Let's hit him with, uh... Let's hit him with a Molotov cocktail we'll follow. Hoping that blows up the car. Blow up the car, blow up the car! Not fast enough. Okay, this is not hurting him that bad, but... Keep fighting him, raiders! I feel like if the raiders keep going at him, it's probably good. It's not happening. Okay. He is not happy with me for some reason. I don't know what I did to him. 
see if he'll, he'll fight some other guys while I hop in here. I'm gonna wait for my AP to recharge. We're gonna do it in bursts. Get my AP up and then I'll run back out there and fight him again. Quick save, we're in good, good shape right now, so. Boom. Whoops. Boom. Boom. Okay, that's gonna hurt. Off with his head. Still looking good, though. We haven't even used a medic uh, stim pack yet. Boom. 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 Oh, yeah. That was beautiful, guys. That's actually not terrible at all for this difficulty. Very happy with our decision. Look at that. What a mess. Oh, what a rush. Okay. It's hurting me. You're hurting me. I'm in danger. The only one who needs a stim pack is dog meat, but he'll be okay. Look at that. What a what a beautiful sight. I'm very happy with that, guys. I hope you guys are pretty happy with that, too. If you've ever played on very hard difficulty, you know that that fight is not pleasant. It is not cool, bro. Excuse me. That was a pretty amazing display. Hey, you said it. Uh-huh. Feelings mutual, Preston. Sure. Listen. You're welcome. Okay. Well. All right, Garvey. I'm in. Please, tell me. Thank you. No. I knew it. Please tell me. I believe I'm correct. Please, Mama Murphy. Look. Mama Murphy, we talked about this. That junk is gonna you kill you. Shush, Preston. We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need you. All right, we're gonna do join Preston in Sanctuary real fast. Repair our armor, and then we're gonna head to Diamond City because that's where we're actually gonna get an upgrade to our baseball bat. Only level five. I am not displeased with this so far. I always find this so annoying. The dismounting. Let's put on our gear for being liked. It's really the only thing we need in our inventory right now. Uh, let's go ahead and keep our vault tech lab coat though, because we'll turn that in. There we go. Just like that. Look at us. Look how likable we are now. Okay, let's sleep for a couple hours. Should give uh, Preston time to get here. And we'll turn in this quest. Let's throw on our Voltec lab coat. Hey, I'm glad you decided to come with us. I should. I think. Yeah. Get this quest turned in. Over two hundred. Should gain another level from this, hopefully. Damn. Right. Anyway, I am glad you're here. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. And I hope you don't mind. So uh -huh. the trouble is, I'd be glad to help. That's been. Mm -hmm. By the way. Not gonna worry about Sturgis's quest. It doesn't give enough experience to spend all that time on. So, let's get going. We're gonna head to Diamond City now. Um, we could... We could go ahead and craft. Might as well, okay. Just to save a little bit of money, we're gonna go ahead and craft something good. 
So this house has a Mentats. I'm not sure if I picked up a Mentats anywhere else. It also has a cap stash and some other goodies. But let's grab our Mentats here. Fresh maker. Ooh, Pompadour wig. Holy cow, we're gonna have the best charisma set ever. Summer shorts, Pompadour wig, black rim glasses. And then uh, we'll head back over to Habernathy, although I need to loot a couple of uh, Let's see, hub flower. There's one. Do I have any more hub flower with me? This is a little not good here. A little bit of wasting of time, but it's okay. Time's on my side. I was very happy with that death claw fight, by the way. I think running back to repair the power armor is something you should do on a lot of runs <laughs> if you're not doing survival. So let's go grab another one of these guys. And then we'll head back to Abernathy, grab a whiskey. We can craft great mint hats here or we can wait until we get to Let's wait until we get to Diamond City, so let's mark that quest. We are not going to... Okay. So, I believe it is this direction. The little shack, this little shack right here. There are some blowflies out there. Should, probably are gonna bother us, actually. I was gonna say they shouldn't bother us, but they definitely are. I actually like melee a lot better with Blitz for dealing with low flies and all these flying guys. They're so annoying to shoot and the accuracy's low. Look at that, there's another one of these. Okay, let's start working our way down. Um, let's go ahead and go this way. Let's go past Ten Pines. I kind of like that route to Diamond City. The other quest I was thinking of doing... Whoa! Wow, what are you guys doing out here? And that's stolen if I do it. I want to do that. The campsite encounter, interesting. Okay. We are just making our way downtown. So the reason I would like to do... I think you get two fusion cores by doing the uh, call to arms quest, but I'm not sure. There are sometimes raiders up here, although it looks like it's like it's just a frag mine this time. I guess this is a bridge encounter. Sometimes it can be raiders. Sometimes it's a some frag mines. Try not to screw this up. I'm looking for more. I don't see any more. All right. Oh, this puts us at Sunshine Tidings, by the way. Very important for survival, I've been told. Look at that. I didn't even have to go farm all that hub flower. There's plenty on the way. Look at all this hub flower. That's good to know, too. The Sunshine Tidings has a bunch of hub flower around it. Okay, working our way south. This has been pretty smooth so far. I'm guessing there's a lot of fusion cores that I'm not getting that I should be. Okay, Arc Jet's coming up, and I know that there's one behind Arc Jet, another fusion core. See if I can figure out where it is. I believe this is Arc Jet that's marked on the mini map down here. And I believe just north of it is another one, although it's guarded by kind of tough bugs. We are bug killers though, our baseball bat is made to kill bugs. So it's not in that. That's where the Bethany is. 
you, if you really don't have a plus two intelligence thing, you can procure one from her. Procure with quotation marks because you have to kill her or steal it from her. She's nice. I don't know why you'd want to do that. All right. So actually, I missed it. It's up here. Oh, let me uh, get the waypoint here first. And then I think there's one outside here as well. Although I'm not sure. This is the exit. I think I'm wrong. I don't think there's one outside. Yeah, so this is where you come out of. And there's no fusion core in here, is there? There's some stuff. I forgot if there's a fusion core somewhere in here. Yeah, but that's where you do arc jet at. All right. I guess it's just up here. This was something that I did a long time ago when I was doing my uh, idiot savant versus genius builds. I found this guy up here. Okay, we got a big nasty bug to deal with while we grab this. Let's see, there he is. Stingwing. Oh, not bad at all. We're fine. On a frail character, that guy's a problem. Okay, let's fast travel back down to Arcjet just to save a little bit of time. Then we'll head south. Random encounter spot, but no random encounter. Dog found something. What up, dog? Okay. Keep working our way down. Ooh, we got something to fight. Just a couple ghouls. Hello, boils and ghouls. No biggie. I am very happy with this on very hard. like crouch down. Sneaking uses your uh, fusion core faster as well as from what I've been told. And I kind of screwed up here. I don't think there's another bridge. Yeah, oh, man, I angled the wrong way. Slight waste. We'll save a little bit of time by beating up these rag. Stag. Rad. Stag. Goes. See, teleported us up a little bit. Yeah, that's Grey Garden ahead of us. We want to cross the bridge at Grey Garden. It's okay. We, we're not doing too bad as far as our path. My nom de plume. Efficient gamer is my nom de plume. I don't know why that word just popped in my head. This is the bridge that you run under when you're going to Arcjet with... Uh, Paladin dance. Dance, dance. And it's the bridge you run across to get to Oberlin Station. Yeah, so fire support. Let's go ahead and grab the quest just in case we decide to do it. It's okay. all. Hit Oberlin Station. Another teleport. Whoop, not yet. Oh, Alpha Mongrel. This guy can be tough. Crit did well. That was pretty good. You know, power armor is a big time game changer on very hard. From all the testing I've done so far, non-power armor builds struggle a lot in the early game. 
the huge jump in damage resistance you get right off the bat with a full set of power armor is just too too much to overlook. All right, so we're at Overland Station. Let's go ahead and start cutting through now. I also kind of worry about sprinting. I think sprinting goes through Fusion Core faster, doesn't it? If we want a real test, we can go to Vault 81 and... Let's do that. Let's go to Vault 81 and fight the Yao Guai. I just want to see what this does. It's kind of on the way. It would also be a good... Sp well, not really. <laughs> I keep thinking, like, what do I need to buy? And there's no ammo. Literally, it's just like fusion cores and one weapon. Maybe some explosives to help out. I don't think we can afford big boy guys. Okay. Before I get jumped by him. Oh, he's right up here somewhere. So weird to put him back here. Right there. Okay, he's got a skull, so I'm a little bit concerned. Okay, that's not great. I'm gonna be honest, that's not great, guys. That's really not great. hit by something else too? I, oh wait, that might be dog meat helping us out. That is dog meat helping us out. So the more time we spend in bats, the less we get hit actually. Bats has inherent damage resistance. Our whole power on <laughs> Wait, is one piece broken? Nothing's broken yet. We got 34 experience. Okay, whatever. Whatever. We did discover Vault 81. No cricket. I, they, like, I'm trying to think of another build besides the one with Spray and Prey that could possibly even beat a Yao Guai there. I don't think any gun-based one would have done a lot better. It's a random encounter over here. Feral ghouls, no big deal. Seems like they don't want none. They don't want none. They don't want none. Uh, we're in caution. I'm trying to figure out where it's from. Maybe up here? Alright. Let's work our way. Diamond City. Oh, there's... Okay. These are the... On like the back side of it, this is interesting. I wonder how we'll do against these guys actually. Not great, to be honest. Okay, but not great. That guy's not messing with me, but good. There's another one. I'm gonna figure out how to get up to him. There's another set of stairs. Is that it? Seems like it. Those things always, okay, here it is. <laughs> I was like, 
Those things always throw me off because it looks like you're going to get some goodies and then it's just a blood covered box. Just decoration. You guys better say thank you. Save the day. Damn. Not a fan of mutants, huh? You're our kind of guy. Our kind of guy. Somehow retaining their Boston accent. But only in Diamond City. All right, let's unequip our weapon here, just so we can get into Diamond City a bit quicker. So if you don't know the dialogue skip trick, you just punch the pixels that represent Piper and then put your hands away. You have the right idea. What do you mean you can't open the gate? Yeah, you have to put your hands away, otherwise she stays hostile. Piper, who let you back inside? I told Sullivan to keep that gate shut. You devious. Okay, I don't care about any of that. We are looking for Mo. 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 Okay. Now, what we're gonna do. We could do story of the century. We might as well do that after we do this. First up, let's uh, get out of our power armor. Make sure no one steals it. Put our beautiful stuff on, including our summer shorts and our pompadour wig. Look how charismatic we look. Holy mackerel, that is some serious charisma. Oozing charisma. Uh, okay, what we want to do now is use the chemistry station here. Should have everything we need to make some great Mentats. Uh, we didn't pick up any beer, did we? That's okay. There might be some on the table here. Doesn't look like it. Whatever, that's just one more charisma. Anyway, we're uh, focusing on Mo. Let's do a hard save just in case I screw this up. Yeah, we don't have any booze on us at all. That's fine. Great Mentats. Sure, let's take a look. Baseball history, right here. Okay, so the weapon we want is the Rockville Slugger, which is actually pretty cheap. This is interesting. I'm looking for, so they all have sharp on them. This one's got sharp on it as well. I was seeing if they had any uh, higher tier ones. We're currently using a higher tier one, which is chain wrapped, which is at 40. So we're actually gonna swap it over uh, when we get back. Let's just sell whatever we don't need, which I don't need that, don't need that. Don't need that. Uh, no, 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 no. No, no. Wow, he can't even buy all this stuff. What am I doing? Okay, sorry, 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 sorry. Give me some. Oh, wait, no, sorry. I missed, I was, I'm looking wrong. Still, we're at minus, by the way. Yeah, that might help. I didn't bring stuff to sell. So I'm just kind of hoping I have enough stuff that I can sell to uh, get there. It's not looking great so far. I really don't want to sell certain things, though. Okay, the Yaogwai meat put us over the top. Oh, I was going to sell ammo, too. Uh, natural baseball bat mod. Yeah, we got ammo to sell. Let's go ahead and sell some 5mm rounds since we're here. Sell uh, 400 of them. There we go. Now what we're going to do is try to buy some fusion cores. Hey! You're the new guy, right? Yeah, I'm the new guy. If we could possibly afford it. I just sold my Nuka Cola. I don't have Nuka Cola to give Sheffield. Whoops. Let's see if he sells it right now. Okay, so he does have fusion cores. They're 360 a pop. Let's see if I have enough ammo uh, to buy a few. Look at that. I have enough to buy all of his fusion cores, actually. Just like that. Uh, even have too much. Big boy's nine thousand. I'm not affording that. 
Old Faithful. This is a core of another build that I'm looking at. It's going to be tough, though. So I can buy back some... Ooh, shipment of... Nah. There we go. Beautiful. We are happy, Pappy. Uh, let's see if we can go ahead and do this now. We're going to take the uh, chain wrapped off of this, and we're going to put it onto our Rockville Slugger. We're upgrading it to chain wrapped. Natural's fine. Aluminium would be good if I had six aluminium. That's a silver slugger. We got to get it. Okay, let's buy some aluminium. Wait, here's some. Oh, that's tin. You? I don't know you. Just keep your. Keep calm. That's ig. Human as the day I was born. Well, we just hit one hour, by the way, guys. Let's see what you got. Odds and ends. And we just got our final weapon. Aluminum can, aluminum canister, aluminum alarm clock. I think that's enough right there, right off the bat. It's, I gotta buy more stuff because I can't waste this opportunity. So let's go buy some uh, chems. Okay, let's get our baseball bat set up now. There we go. Yeah, we got it. That's our silver slugger right there. That 40% reduction is going to be very helpful, by the way. This better be an emergency. Could use some supplies. Uh, let's see what I can spare. Let's see, he's got stim packs. Let's see if I can how much I can buy. Not a lot. And that's fine. Look at that. I don't care about that extra money, by the way. Normally I do, I don't like to give extra money, but those stim packs are going to be pretty darn helpful. Let's go ahead and get a, a point in Medic now. That'll help us quite a bit with healing. Now we've got a ton of stuff. Let's go do uh, Piper's Story of the Century. So here's the deal. You do that? All right, Piper. Good. Sure. So I... Uh-huh. My family and I were frozen. Wait. Uh-huh. Yes. <laughs> so... Honestly, seeing it... That. Now the uh, big question. My son, Sean. The parents... Sure sounds like they might be. Not even a baby. For the last part of our interview, I'd like to do... Mm. The threat of... Uh-huh. No matter how much you want to give up. Strong... Right. That's everything. Look, about your son. Thanks, Piper. I'll talk to him. He'll like you. Anyway, I agreed to come with you. Don't need Piper. There we go, another level. <clears throat> I feel like we just need to focus on levels now. This is going to be our main bat now. What have you done with the real... Whoa. Oh, look at all those hits we can get. Kyle, no! That is awesome, guys. There are no in Diamond City. Wow. I thought it was going to be... I was only getting like three hits before. Now I'm getting like eight, I guess. The way it's calculated is odd, but that is a ton of bats hits. What a nice baseball bat to use. We are gonna live in bats, guys. Something wrong. Another stray coming in from the rain. Sorry. I'll come back later. No. Don't worry, I can help. 
There's an old ball. I'll find it. You have my word. Dang. I could have persuaded her. Oh shoot, let's do that. Whoops. Let's persuade her since we still have our charisma boost going. Let's make sure we still do. Yes, we still have six charisma. Something wrong. Another stray coming in from the rain. We have more like this though. So this will pass all three checks. Sorry. Off I know you must be busy. Get You're some right. experience. I'm sorry. Don't worry, I can help. There's an old Hey, I'd love to help, but the money, huh? Come on. This is your boss's life we're talking about. Fine. We'll make it 150 caps. Last chance. Put some real money on Okay. You win. I'll find him. You have my Okay. Order. Thank you. Nick should I'm pretty happy with this, guys. Pretty darn happy with this. Freedom Trail doesn't do much for us. This would be okay. I think I'll just do Nick Valentine's quest. But we'll... I feel like we can get through it. No. What we're going to do is we're going to travel uh, out. Oops. We're going to travel out and we're going to get to the entrance and then we're going to teleport back. Teleport. Fast travel back. And uh, then we'll repair our armor right before we go in. Because we are going to get hit a lot in there, by the way. We're definitely going to get hit quite a bit. I like where we're at with fusion cores. I think we're at a point where we're sustaining fusion cores pretty well. Let's use a level again. We got another level up. We can get another rank of big leagues, and now we have a chance to disarm opponents. Another great reason why big leagues is awesome. Rest. The only other ones we could do is Action Boy. That would be good. Second rank of Blitz is not coming until 29. That's one of the biggest issues with this is just Blitz rank 2 changes things a lot. Like, your distance doubles, I believe, or even more, maybe more than doubles. Like, one rank is pretty nice, two ranks is game-changing. Those signs pointing us the correct direction. Okay, Diamond City security. Oh, we got puppies. Gosh, this is awesome. Boom, big crit. Thanks for the help, Diamond City Security. Jerks. I like to head up north for this. Although, maybe I'm wrong. Yeah, I kind of like to approach it from the side. Because, uh... It seems to be a little bit cleaner. I'm not gonna go up there. I'm gonna go up the main road here. Take a right up here. Although this is a bit sketch. Beautiful. Whoops, another one. Well, sometimes out of vats hits harder. I think if I hit him in the head. Oh, okay, it's the public library. Int bobblehead. 
That could be good to get. Not gonna worry about it right this moment, though. What is this building? Trinity Plaza, okay. Not Trinity Tower. Help! Or Mayday, or whatever you say. Greater Psycho. Oh. If we beeline for Swan, then we shouldn't get attacked. Hubris Comics, there's a dead guy outside. Poor dead guy, he's got a blue bandana. One of these days I'm gonna get the rare bandana. Forgot what it's even called. All right. We are at Swan Lake. Oh. Okay, we got three reds, so we'll go ahead and fast travel back. Once we discover the entrance here. Mikhail. Tour bot. Just fast travel back super quick to Sanctuary. We still have 50 minutes, guys. I don't even know what to do after this. I guess just try to get more levels. Uh, we could do first step. We could run through Corvega. That might be fun. Let's do that. After we finish this, we'll go over to Ten Pines and run through Corvega. Oh, we need more steel crap. Steel. I like the steel sk. Hey, how did she get here? I didn't even talk to her. Crash can Carla, how'd you get here? I thought I had to engage with you. Yeah? Hey there. So what's your story? Looking to trade? Just looking for love, sweetheart. <laughs> but hey, the, finally an outfit that fits that. Uh, maybe actually, let's see. Do you have any fusion cores on you, Carla? You again? Here to. I'll take a look. Sure. Here's what I got. Take a look. It's in a book. A reading rainbow. She does not have fusion cores. Okay. You like that? She does not. I saw fusion cells and then went, whoops. All right, uh, just gonna scrap these just so I don't have to keep worrying about this crud. Should be plenty of steel. Oh, these guys deserve to die. Ooh, I could use them. I could wear a blue dress instead of summer shorts. Summer shorts are just too beautiful, though. They're so vibrant. So vibrant. Okay. Whoops. Craft again. I don't have any circuitry. Uh oh. Okay, I gotta buy some circuitry from her. Okay, that's a good call. I'm glad she's here. That's very lucky. Very fortuitous. Why are you equipping it? I don't want you to equip it. Girl. Okay. Carla. You again. Here to trade. <sighs> it's just kind of annoying that the I chest requires well. circuitry, but nothing I'm glad nothing else does. Junk. I should have marked it. That's the, my bad. Circuitry. Hyper optics, not circuitry. Wait, none of these have circuitry. A telephone? Yes! Oh! Jeez Louise, that was a close one, guys. 
Let's get the Wonder Glue as well. Sell these two weapons. Sell these two batons. Baton. Baton. We can uh, sell that now because we've got enough. There we go. All right. Repair. Uh, let's see. Wait a minute. No, hold on. How hurt is it? No, it's at 197. I'm not going to bother. Don't waste a circuitry on something that's at 197. That's stupid. Thanks for your junk. And let's go. It's weird how certain parts get hit and the other parts don't. The helmet didn't get touched at all. I guess that Yao Guai was kind of short, so he was just beating on my legs a little bit. How are we going to do in here? I feel good about this, guys. I'm loving this weapon, actually. I didn't realize it was really that much of a difference with the uh, VATS hits. It'd be really cool to stack this with luck, but... The int that we got is more important than the luck. I wouldn't trade int for luck in this build because the power armor is so key. So we're sacrificing crits, but we're still doing plenty of damage. One of the main benefits of crits is that they're guaranteed not to miss. And we don't have to worry about that with melee anyway. Look at that. Oh my gosh, I am. I am happy, boys. Pick up the weapons so we get that ammo, so we can buy more fusion cores as we need. Oil can. It's fun to blitz through and just teleport back here. This is a very strong build, by the way. Legitimately very strong. I was a bit uh, cautious about this to begin with, but now I'm feeling great about it. Blitz range is okay. Yeah, rank one's not terrible. Rank two would have gotten to him. Oh man, that was gorgeous, guys. How can you not love that? So, don't sprint. I guess is one thing, you know, you just kind of tank your way through, save your action points up. That's sort of a key to this, save your action points for when you need them. Sprinting also will use fusion cores faster, supposedly. Or supposedly, as I like to say, to annoy people. I always love that glowing Nuka Quantum back there. I'm loving it. This is a lot of fun, guys. And very hard difficulty as well. This saves you the stupid time of plugging in your pit boy if you're wearing power armor, so that's good. I think maybe I'll finish this up with Corvega. And maybe we'll take a swing at Swan as well, just to see how we're doing. Corvega's got so much experience for us. And blitzing around in Corvega is going to be really fun. Although the outside's not going to be as fun. The inside's going to be fun, though. Hey, I got a baseball bat, too. I don't know. This almost feels easier than the last build. Why the hell would anyone build a vault? 
Keep telling people, don't sleep on melee. Essentially, this makes a slow, this, this, uh, bats enhanced version of this baseball bat makes a slow weapon into a fast weapon in terms of AP cost. And that's incredible. Getting kind of close to needing to heal, but, you know. We've definitely gained a lot more stim packs than we've used so far. Okay, cool. Yeah, just an enamel bucket. The other thing that's just so liberating is not worrying about ammo when you're doing melee. Ammo is literally just money. All right. We'll go beat up Dino. I think we got a crit saved up for him. I'm going to guess the crit's going to do three quarters of his health. Ooh, I was pretty close. It was more like 85, 90% of his health. Let's go ahead and drop a bunch of stuff so I don't have to worry about it later. All these submachine guns can go on the ground. Again, I'm picking these up because you get ammo when you pick them up. You get whatever's left in the clip. Shining armor. Why does he come all this way? Risk life and limb. An old private. Ah, my son, Sean, is missing. I'm a jerk. Anyway. Okay, let's do it the fast and easy way. Let's go ahead and use a stim pack. I'm not trying to be too arrogant. Some of these are just randomly more tanky. It's interesting. A lot of these are just one hit, and then some of them are like three or four hit. Not 100% certain why. So this is where Nick will come in. Braxo cleaner. That's supposed to be like. I forgot what it's called. There's a powder soap. I'm wondering, in real life, is that a uh, acid or a base? Because I know some cleaners are acids and some are bases, and that's why you don't mix them. In this game, it's got acid because you scrap it for acid. So the ones who are the ones who are more tanky, it doesn't seem to matter if they're melee or not, because you think that maybe the melee ones are a bit more tanky, but it doesn't seem to matter. Like this one, he's more tanky. Maybe it's the ones holding the 10 millimeters. I've noticed it was a couple with the 10 millimeters, so maybe that's what it is. Let's go ahead and bust this guy open. Nice. Okay. Leave Nick alone. Another level, by the way. Let's see what we can use it on. 
right now I don't have a lot to use it on. Uh, chemist, robotics expert, no. Uh, action boy. That's what we're going to use it on. It's also pretty liberating not worrying about sneak. Whoops. Nope, it's definitely not just the 10 millimeter ones. There we go. Probably should have saved that crit for later, I just realized. It's okay. Yeah, I think we're literally just about to leave. Ugh. Should have saved the crit. That's okay, we'll, we'll do it crit free. Sans crit. Should we try to convince our uh, girl to leave? Well, we don't have any actually. We don't have another great Mentats, otherwise we might be able to, but we'll just beat them all up. It's fine. Okay, got it. We could also just chuck a frag grenade at them first. Let's see what we got. Or... Yeah, we can throw frags under them. And, interestingly, I think if we're in vats, we'll survive. So we want to trigger vats, and then the mines will blow them up, and while we're still in vats, maybe that'll work. This could create a pretty cool thumbnail. Not thumbnail, pretty cool clip for the video. Okay, do a hard save here just in case. Let's uh, get our frag mines and just. You have any idea how much this is gonna set me back? I wouldn't be here if it weren't for your two timing game. to tell her to write home. Okay, now. Let's go for Skinny Malone, because he's going to take the most to kill. Look at that. <laughs> and we just ate it, too, because we were in bats. That worked really well. Sequin dress, okay. This room. Yeah, people always say put it down when you walk in. I always forget though. You can always put mines down afterwards, doesn't matter. So next up we'll do Ten Pines Bluff and Corvega. I don't think we need to worry about our armor. We still should be pretty solid on our uh, power armor. So we'll go ahead and just go through it. That'll get us some more e experience. Although we want to finish this quest. I don't remember if it finishes out here. Never thought anything so naturally ominous could end up looking so inviting. Thanks for getting me out. Mm -hmm. Your secretary, Ellie. She did? Sure. Now, I I'll meet you there. See you in Diamond City. Okay, that does complete it, so I don't have to go back to Diamond City, thankfully. Good. That's not enough experience for a big quest like that. That's annoying. Uh, still nothing else to use it on. Action Boy. Let's go ahead and save it for now. Yeah, we'll go ahead and save it. I can't do rank 3 of that until 15. 16 for that. So let's head back to... Uh, let's go over to Ten Pines Bluff. I hope you guys are feeling good about this build. I feel much better about it than actually when I came in. Uh, baseball Bat has huge scalability. So as you get more ranks of Blacksmith, the, the damage is going to be tops like with the nuka world stuff it's going to be up there i think sledgehammers might compete with it but this particular baseball bat is so strong in bats and then on top of that you get just crazy damage i think this could turn out to be an amazing build even later on it'll just going to continue to scale with power as you oh the puppy's playing on his back <laughs> Oh, 
Why'd they have to make him like roll around on his back all cute? Yeah, the charge up crit. We sent word. Most people don't. Mm -hmm. We're rebuilding the Minutemen. For Glad to hear it. Uh -huh. There's a raider gang that's been giving us. We know we're there. Don't okay. worry. Thanks. Good. I actually wanted Corvega. Most of the time you don't want. Okay, cool. Actually, Arcjet's not too far off of Corvega. Let's go. I think Corvega is going to be a really nice chance to show off here. Our fusion core sustainability, I think we're in a really good spot, especially with all those ex all that extra ammo we got, we can always go to Diamond City and buy more. Whiskey. Gotta get more whiskey and mintats though. But that's not a big deal. Rai whiskey, rai whiskey, rai whiskey, I cry. I'm not gonna finish this song because I just realized it has an inappropriate, outdated term in it. Oh my gosh, another Yao Guai. Yao Guai 2.0. We're back again, son. Why are we always trying to fight these Yao Guai? so hard. Try to charge up a little bit. Look at that crit. Love it. The other thing we could have possibly farmed for this, uh, although I don't think it's necessary right now, but if you're planning on continuing on with this build, definitely get the melee bobblehead. Definitely get the uh, get the grognak books, as many as you can, and start pumping into luck, and start stacking the crit stuff, and especially Grim Reaper Sprint. Once you get Grim Reaper Sprint, I think this build is just it's just going to be the best. I really like that we didn't have to spend the first half hour scrapping Sanctuary. <laughs> that was the most annoying part about the previous build. Uh, definitely a big upside of this one. We don't have to worry about money for this at all. The, uh, the Rockville Slugger is so cheap that just with basic stuff we found, we didn't have to craft any Caltrops or anything. We just, all the ammo we got along the way was plenty. Okay, this is gonna be interesting. Let's see what we can do here. Get a little closer. A little closer. There we go. Oops. Shoot. Can't get up to that guy. There we go. One shot on that raider. Good. This guy's gonna take a couple. He's a scum. Only two though. That was not too bad at all. The other ones are up there. I can't get to them right now, so I'm just gonna go inside. And not worry about it right now. Maybe they'll follow me in. I hope they follow me in actually. That'd be cool. Okay, let's go and use a stim pack. We'll get plenty in here. We need to get to that thing right now. No? No, we can't. We gotta get to that. That guy, come on. Now oh, he got disarmed. Okay. Okay. 
upgrade on that guy. Bro, this is so strong. This build is so freaking strong. I have to double check. <laughs> I just literally had to double check. This does not feel like very hard. I don't know how to explain this. As someone who just plays very hard all the time, right at the beginning of the game, this feels like I'm playing on normal. Like, the amount of damage I can take and stuff, it doesn't make sense. You... Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, I'll, I'll shut up. We're down in the basement area now. There's some... A lot of stuff to fight down here. It is on. I'm not even going to bother looting now, I just want to get through this. I mean, just having so much, so many hits available in bats. How have I never used this baseball bat before? This is the best baseball bat in the game. I'm going to say that. I would take this bat over even like an instigating. I would take this over a custom baseball bat that you can find. There's more bad stuff. Okay, actually. We're kind of heading up where the boss is, so that's good. Let's just deal with the boss for now. There's a Mentats. That's good. We can almost make a... If we get another whiskey, make another great Mentats. Now this part's going to be hard. This part's actually going to be pretty hard because we're going to get lit up by that thing while we're crossing here. And there's nothing we... I don't know if we can reach up there. Jared! No, Jared! Bad Jared. Hey, there's a grognak here as well. Yeah, that's another good reason to come here. Forgot about that until I was inside the building. Can't hit it. Alright, well, let's see what we got. Maybe we got a uh got some SMGs, that's fine. It's a lot of ammo. Two of our items are down. Whoa. Taking a bit more damage than we want, but we have a lot of stim packs. I feel like this is a this has got a lot of nice moments to edit into the video. What is going on here? I don't care. I don't care. Okay. This outside area will be interesting. I'm pretty hurt, actually. This might not be the best idea to do this. Like you can see, two of my pieces are busted right now. But let's go for it. What were they doing in there? What were they doing in... Okay, they were doing like a... Drugs or something, I guess.
There's another disarm. Love it. Love the disarm. This guy's just kind of chilling. Doesn't realize there's someone behind him. The uh, blitz is a little weird about terrain and like height and stuff. Sometimes it lets you get away with it and sometimes it doesn't. Like sometimes it seems like it's straight distance and sometimes it's like, well, you gotta path around to get to him first. This guy. Come on, see? Whoa, the stomp. That was a stomp got him. Nice, too. All right, I'm about to just head out here, guys. Not really sure that I care to get the, uh, the bobblehead. Maybe we can do Ten Pines Rescue real quick, too. Yeah, let's do that. Let's see if we can teleport. Teleport? Why do I keep saying that? Fast travel. <laughs> Fast travel. Turn this quest in. Hopefully it'll get us to level 10. Then we'll go to Oberlin Station, pick up a new quest after we repair everything. Because they're working on the fields. Those raiders? Yeah. I just no kidding. So we've been talking. If we want things, so. Okay. Talk to Preston to turn this quest in. Hey, that rhymed. <laughs> Talk to Preston to turn the quest in. Maybe that's why he keeps giving you quests. He's waiting for that rhyme. What is he doing? What are you doing, Preston? I'm not in Preston. You know that settlement you sent me to help? They've decided to join the Minutemen. That's great news. I knew you were the right person. Right. By the way, mm -hmm. it'll get more. I don't think. I figured you'd tell me when you were ready. That's... You guys came from Quincy. That's right. I was with Colonel Hollis. There we go. Another level. As long as you don't give up. I'm not. That's... Hey, that means a lot coming from you. I appreciate it. Okay, I'll do it. Good. Don't sure. <laughs> Believe it. Are the one good. Now nah. I've heard that folks. Are... Anything else? Uh huh. Let's travel with Preston. Oh my God, Finch Farm. Jeez, Louise, that would be a test, but that's okay. Come with me. Sure thing. Don't worry, doggy. <laughs> Preston is testing. Okay. Those summer shorts every time they shock me when I get out. Okay. First, let's transfer junk. Let's transfer random stuff. Keep the fat man with us just in case still. Actually, those Molotovs would be nice to keep as well. Let's do that too. Molotov. Okay. Next up, you know what perk that would probably actually be really beneficial right now is uh, Ninja. Even though I'm not, even though I'm not often um, stealth attacking, I could like get the jump on certain enemies with the stealth attack, and that might be pretty massive. Okay, our armor's good. Let's do that. Let's put a point into ninja. Yeah, so that's gonna bring sneak attack, melee sneak attacks to four times damage. So if I can actually get a melee sneak attack off, it's gonna be huge. I'm not sneaky at all, but with blitz, it's certainly possible. 
We could add to sneak, but I'm not going to worry about sneak all that much. Let's save it. I don't know what else to use a point on. Let's see. I think we got enough time to go to Oberlin Station and then rescue the... Uh, hopefully they'll give us Backstreet. Backstreet's back. If they give us Backstreet apparel, we'll be in really good shape. to finish one more quest at least. Hey there. Which one are you? Easy living this ain't. The farm's not much. Yes, it's neither of them. Excuse me. Back to Diamond City. Uh, is there one more? Why am I not getting a quest from them? Don't think I have to wait for Preston to give me a quest in here. Oh my gosh, this is dumb. here okay. try one more time I maybe this is just not happening yes I mean this is it no never mind all right is it because of that don't care much for good news that place is nothing but trouble. Another day of work. Never changes. Hi. You know what I call a good day? It's not working. He's not working. I think I'm wasting my darn time. Um. Let's see. What other quest can we do? I mean, we. That's crazy to go to Finch Farm, Finch Farm and try to do that. That doesn't make any sense. Let's do... Maybe we can go in here, Boston Public Library. This would be a good test. Or I could just call it finished, right? I could let's let's go kill Swan. Okay, you know what? I mean, even though it's way short of two hours, I don't think I'm gonna get a lot stronger anytime soon. So let's go to Swan. Uh, let's see if we can get a nice kill on Swan, and then if we get a nice kill on Swan, we'll call that a video, and we'll say uh, we succeeded. It's not gonna be easy, but I think if I can get a crit off on him. If I can get a sneak crit to start, that'll be pretty huge. Okay. Okay, quick save. Detected, I don't like that. What am I being detected by? There we go, hidden. Not close enough. Not close enough. Not close enough. Not close enough. Ugh. There we go. We're close enough now. Okay. Let's see what we can do. Big crit to start. Okay, that's the best we're going to get on that. Um, 
Um, do I have any meds at all? We got medics. Let's go ahead and use that. Maybe jet in a second here. He's actually getting stunned a lot here. Where are these stuns coming from? It's my turn. Okay, I think one big crit here is going to finish him. Big crit. Oh! Oh my gosh, that is awesome. Just to get that verification at the end of the video. And that we're only level 10. Level 10. Inventory, yeah. All right, you guys, we're short of two hours, but I am very, very satisfied with this. I hope you guys are satisfied with this as well. The Rockville, the Silver Slugger uses Rockville Slugger, Power Armor. This is, this exceeded my expectations. I'll just say that far, far exceeded my expectations. As soon as I got this 40% less action point cost and I was able to just do like six or seven hits in one round of action points, that changed everything. So uh, let me know what you guys think of this build. There will be another video, obviously, with a short version that goes through everything. Uh, but yeah, I'm very happy, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.